welcome once more great people of Biafra, lovers of freedom. I especially welcome you to today's uh, program. Uh, we'll be discussing about uh, Umaya, the place the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra hails from. We'll be talking about their actions and their inactions. We will be talking about their actions and inactions as regards this struggle. We will be talking about what they have done and what are the evils that they are doing against their own brother. But before we go into discussing that, I want to play this confession to you. I want us to listen to this confession. Just listen. Family are too poor now. Come back on a cave is up, Macaw in a quiz up. I hang a quiz up. Oh, not to win with you. You will lay road of your movies. It's all in with you. That is none of my business. Media baru no baru since day one. And onion do the way onion do said the struggle also make his sibling believe that this is the way it is. And the, the leaders we have, and I'm at once, they make a lot of also mistakes, you know, because on what they have, come on, come on, come come on, 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 for you people to know that you twice were put the mistakes the leadership made when all this thing is happening, both that now. Open no makare papa no through from mass she gave those to everybody. Mass open no to a gig is where made this thing. I come out there. Gaba, I want to resign. Let me just resign. Let me just resign. Open no to a gig is so why they see where they. Let me resign. Or no, I open you put or do to her. Let me resign. Let me resign. And I'm still standing on that road today. Oh, but so open now. Oh, now I have to go. Now I have to go now. I'm going to carry. Carry by now resign. I'm going to now. I'm going to buy now. That's nothing like uh, resigning this struggle. Oh, two angels near where? Highest. Eh, there are people. We have already expel. Or we may say expel. Or we may not make you come. Can you come now? Now. Of course, it's too much. It's too much. That is why Mazin Namdekanu travel to Kenya. That is why Mazin Namdekanu is only person that is communicating with Mazin Namdekanu is Kanu. And the one they call uh, 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 um, Kafia. Um, um, secretary to onion do. Even on all game mazishin as a more kuokua. See that na the secretary of onion do say na onion do siniati a life yana ka secretary. It's not only mazishin as a kogorokua. She told me I communicated with these people almost going to five months. The secretary of onion do told me the same. Told me the same. Even though there are some things that you wanted to, I say, well, don't tell me that nonsense. I don't want to hear. You are talking about my leader. Now, in this confession, this is one of those people who trust and believe in the duos and continue to shout, the, the dogs are wise. The dogs are wise. The dogs are wise. Look at him today confessing how the duos have messed up the struggle. Look at him confessing how the DOS have made several mistakes that would have pushed them into resigning and saying, no, they are not going to follow you again. You are not going to lord us into decisions and we follow you, no. Look at him confessing how Mazin Amdekano have, you know, lost faith in these people. Look at him telling you that Mazin Amdekan once said that he placed his life in the hands of his secretary because he knows that these people have failed him. 
and he went further to say that was why Mazenam they can travel to Kenya without letting them know but they knew through the secretary and through other means that they have placed around uh, Mazenam the Kanu. they knew they got information of wherever he was but our people cannot open their eyes even the people who support the deal and who continue to shout the dogs are wise the dogs are wise you cannot even you know look into things and see the truth for yourself and know that these people are not working for Mazenam de Kanu or for the Biafran people if you so much love Mazenam de Kanu you wouldn't be shouting the duo as a wise you wouldn't be following these people he would look for who Mazenam de Kanu entrusted the struggle into and who is that person he entrusted the struggle into it is Mazi Ekbasai Monunjoko and why am I saying this? Because the only opportunity he had for, for him to speak directly to the people and tell them um, who he has trust in, the only person he made mention was Simon Ekba. Immediately he got into that prison. He said Simon Ekba should take charge of Radio Biafra. And who was he and what was he before he was kidnapped? He was the director of Radio Biafra. And so when he tells someone to take charge of that Radio Biafra, who he was um, a director of, it means that he wants you to take charge of his office. And once you take charge of his office, you begin to do what he does. And that is why we continue to tell you that Mazenam de Kana has already transferred power to Simon Ekba a long time ago. But most of you continue to misbehave continue to think that we are just blabbing but today your eyes are open today i believe you can see clearer those of you who do not want to see clearer it means you are purposely committing atrocities crime against your own people because you have seen the truth but you do not want to change now the next thing is the people of umaya and afara to be precise why have you decided to forsake your own brother why have you decided to forsake your own brother people will continue to say that a king is not recognized in his own hometown yes we know about that but then it gets to a level where at least his home people needs to say something people in Aba, people in Onicha, people in different places, people in Okiwe, people in so many areas of Biafra land are on every Monday doing sit at home to protest the release of Mazenam de Kanu, to protest against the injustices method of Mazenam de Kanu, who as a person represents the people of Biafra. But his own people, the people of Umaya, continue to go about their businesses like nothing happened even on mondays umaya is the only city that continues to go about their businesses without even thinking about their own brother their own brother their own brother their own son their own child they do not want to even protest even one day for their own brother but tomorrow, if Mazenam de Kanu comes out, they begin to shout, He is our brother, he is our this, he is our that. But do something for him. Show your support, show your solidarity for him. You cannot do anything. You continue to go about your businesses, even when Aba, other cities or Kikwe are doing sit at home every Mondays for your own brother. You that is the owner of that child, you that that child is your son. You don't want to do anything in support of your brother. You continue to go about your businesses. Every Monday you see Umaya very filled and you know businesses going on. But other communities, other areas, other places are shut down completely. Who is fooling who? I think it's high time the Biafran people shook Umaya. Umaya needs to be shaken seriously. He needs to be seriously shaken because they don't even want to respect their own brother who is doing something tangible for them 
who has done what no governor has done for them who is opening their eyes who is fighting for their own welfare they can't even do something for his own welfare they can't even do something to show their support for him evil in the land evil in the land umaya needs to be shaken umaya needs to be shaken umaya needs to be shaken my prime minister sir with all due respect umaya needs to be shaken the men and women of the Biafra Liberation Army, Biafra Resistance Fighters, Biafra Navy, Biafra Air Force, Umaya needs to be shaken. With all due respect to you men on ground, Umaya needs to be shaken. Umaya needs to be shaken. I rest my case. Udo Dirunu.